Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. For those who are new to my channel, my name's Elaine. I'm the owner of what? LBE. Happy Monday, y'all. Happy Monday. Your girl has been busy. <laughs> Uh, but I never stopped making Mother's Day gifts, okay? It may not have been some big extravagant ones, but it was some small ones. Either way it go, I had to get it in where I fit it in, okay? Um, so I have been trying to, of course, um, I'm a procrastinator. Well, I'm not a procrastinator, but, um, I have been meaning to get my tax lady the last few of my documents. And I just, y'all, anyway, don't come for me in the comments, but she finally got them and my taxes are done. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Um, but anyway, um, been dealing with that and then having to, um, fill in, um, for my friend with her catering business. For those of y'all who saw the previous video, one of the previous videos, I showed you the charcuterie table. Uh, that was at an actual wedding. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. She had to set up a charcuterie table at a wedding and she was already booked at another event. So she called me and asked me, could I go set it up? Um, and I said, sure. Um, and we got five star reviews on it on her website. Woo woo. Uh, or I, I don't know if it's a website or her Facebook page. I don't know. But anyway, she got five star reviews on the table. Okay. Uh, I said, you already know I'm not going to make you look bad. You know, this is your business. I'm going to respect your business just like I respect mine. I would never let somebody make somebody's business look bad. That's just not my, ever my intentions to do so. Um, I wanted to make sure that she knew that I had her back. Okay. Um, so anyway, set the table up. The mother of the bride was from New York and, uh, she just was in awe of our work um and i say our because i don't need this is not my business <laughs> i just help out when she need me to help out um so anywho got that done and i've been rocking and rolling ever since so i want to come ahead and show you guys these right here because i know that you guys were going to give me questions uh, and i got answers okay so the boxes are these right here these are the floral boxes you can get these from amazon um i don't know if they're still in stock yet i haven't went back on there and checked so as i'm talking to you don't think i'm being rude but i'm gonna get on there and check just so you know and i know they still available okay uh because i know some of you guys are asking me about them and you may not use them now but you may use them later but either way it go i'm gonna make sure they on there so y'all can um be able to use them so let's scroll and see if i can find these boxes real quick um and i can tell you yay or nay okay here we go um, so they come in an 80 piece set. They were a part of, um, and yes, they still are available. They were a part of, I believe, the Valentine's Day collection because they say, um, they're called flower gift bags, paper wedding bouquet box with handles. Uh, I don't know why they put bags in there. I guess because you can hold it with a handle as if it was a bag. I don't know. But they're boxes. Uh, anywho you can put like just regular flowers in here or you can put whatever um this is i believe a part of the valentine's day collection because um the colors are red hot pink light pink and white which is normally kind of like in the valentine's day range however y'all know with all those colors you can still use them for what mother's day so i took it upon myself to go ahead and purchase them because why they are 53 percent off um you get 80 of them for 27 dollars um, basically $27.99 so we'll just say $28 and that is about 35 cents a box can't beat it okay um, so when you put them together this is what they look like um, and what I did was I made sure that as you can see right here I made sure that part was taped down and this part was taped down and then I taped it down in the seam right here in the middle because y'all know I like security okay when I put stuff on here the last thing I want is for this to open up <laughs> and things come falling out which it is very firm it is very firm down here but i don't take no chances okay um and they come with these little um circles at the top and basically what i did was i put them together and i just tied each one with fish line so that it stays together like that uh because that's how i want it to look once you do that uh you're going to cut yourself a piece of foam block this is if you're adding flowers to it cut yourself a piece of foam block i use the dry foam block i get mine from michael's because you get a better deal you get six of these for $4.99. And if you set up, sign up with Michael's Rewards, it's totally free. You get a 20% off coupon every now and then. Sometimes you get a 50% off coupon. It's like a win-win situation, especially if you're messing with floral, okay? Um, and then on top of that, as you keep buy buying stuff from there, you get the rewards, which turns into cash. So sometimes you ain't got to come out your pocket at all. Don't say I didn't put you on the game, okay? <laughs> so the next thing is, um, I know you guys have been asking me what's all inside of the box. 
There's only three Dollar Tree items. The small little clutches that I showed you guys, the little wristlets um, that I showed you guys, I found at my local Dollar Tree. Just cute little wristlets, nothing, you know, spectacular. Um, also, it comes with uh, one of the inspirational flip books. Again, Dollar Tree. Uh, you should find it either up there by the cash register where the prayer cards are, or in the section, um, kind of like in the middle. You know how you have like the eyeglasses in the middle up there by the registers that's got the little display section over there that has like um, pins and all the little trinkets and stuff. You'll find you should find these over there as well if your Dollar Tree has them. Um, and then the last thing is. Of course, the number one thing everybody's trying to figure, you know, not figure out, but trying to do something with are the tumble cups. Um, so I added, you know, my tumble cups to kind of match the color scheme in the um, the books and the bags. So as you can see, I paired these two together, which goes really, really well. And then I just added in the cup. So this is the color scheme I went with for this particular one. And then I have one that, that went with the turquoise cup and the uh, hot pink cup. Um, and then... For these right here, I know you guys are hitting me up about the little straw tips. They came from Amazon. You get a 30 pack of multicolored um, straw protection uh, tips or whatever. Um, and you, they are $8, like $8.19 for 30. Um, I just wanted to invest in them because again, these are these are not being wrapped. I don't know if I said that or not, but they are not being wrapped in cellophane. So I don't just don't want no bug going flying down. <laughs> Which I know they probably won't, but you know, you just can't never take a chance. And I just like the way they color scheme flow with it and it makes it look a little bit more high end. Um, and I know it's crazy to say, but it kind of does. It adds a little extra flavor to the cup. Uh, so people be like, oh, I like that cup and not even paying attention that, you know, in most cases, some people don't really shop at Dollar Tree. So they can't tell you what's there and what ain't there. Um, but anywho, I just wanted to make it a little bit more fancier. Y'all know me. I'm a little extra. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to go through these little um, boxes that I put together. So this is the white box. I use white, light pink, and um, the hot pink ones. Um, the red ones I'm going to use for a totally different concept. But um, this is what they look like. I got the prayer book, I mean the flip book in the front. And then, I don't know why I'm walking all the way up to this thing, but I can clearly zoom in. <laughs> um, I got the turquoise cup to go with that one. And the reason why I have turquoise cup go with this one, because I don't know if you guys can see, but it has a hint of blue in it. I don't know if y'all can see that or not. Um, so I decided to pair that with the turquoise cup, and then I just added in the pink, um, the pink wristlet bag in the back, and it sits in nice and neat. As you can see, it's nice and firm in there. Like I'm having to pull to get it out, um, which is a great thing. I put the straps on the side here, and then I added in my filler. The filler I chose to use is my natural wood filler. Um, I just think it goes with the aesthetics of the flowers. Um, I get mine from World Market. If you have a World Market in your city or state, um, feel free to go in there. They have some really nice things. And this is one of the best quality um, items I have always purchased from them. Now, I can't tell you what the price is because I told you I buy in bulk. So, <laughs> And plus, they give you discounts too if you sign up for the rewards points. So, I try to save as much money as I can. Y'all know me. I, I'm not, yeah. I try to save on everything. Um, so anyway, I buy it in bulk. So I haven't bought it in several months because I don't use it in every basket, but I still got about six or seven bags over here. Um, and then I took my fall florals, y'all. These are fall florals. The fall florals that came from Dollar General um, when uh, they had that big sale. Now, I got mine at 90%, so like some of the bushes, bushels was like 30 cents. Some were like 10 cents. Some were like 20 cents. I don't think anything was over 30 cents. Yeah, no, none of them were over 30 cents, I don't believe. Um, so anyway, that's where I got mine from. It may have been a few that was like 60 cents, but... Um, no, 30 cents was it. Um, so I just took a few pieces from all them different floral picks and just tied it in and just made it do what it do. I am by no means a floral designer, okay? Um, so if it's something on here that doesn't does not look right to you, listen, don't come for me. I just, I did the best I could and I made it look as pretty as I could, okay? Um, I'm still learning. I'm still in the learning process. <laughs> but, um, and actually this is my second, yeah, this is my second uh, holiday using floral like this and putting these type of arrangements together. So, yeah, your girl is trying. Just know that. <laughs> Um, so anyway, I took pool bowls. Yes, I said pool bowls because baby, when I tried to tie an actual bow on this thing, 
the polar thing was just starting to go like this. I said, oh, no, we can't do that. We got to keep it, keep it light, keep it light. So, um, I decided to go with my pool bowls. My pool bowls came from, um, my cellophane bags. When I order cellophane, there's three different kind of cellophane bags that I order. 18 by 30s, 24 by 30s, and 32 by 40s. Um, the ones that I found on Amazon actually come with pool bowls. So if you order a pack of 100, guess what? You're getting 100 pool bowls. If you order a pack of 50, you're getting 50 pool bowls. So that's what I did. Um, and with the ones that I ordered, I was able to get gold bowls, red bowls, and uh, these pink bowls. So I took two of the bowls and put it on here because I wanted it to be full. Um, and here is the hot pink box. Now on this one, I took a gold bowl and a pink bowl because I wanted this one to be a little different um because of the simple fact that the box is already like a whole lot of pink and as you can see the balloon i chose to use has pink and gold flowing in it so i kind of want to kind of like coexist that and match it up um and then of course here is the floral that i decided to use on this particular box um this is one of the flip books this is a multicolored like uh rainbow type color so i paired that with this box um and then i paired it with the pink um tumbler cup and of course, y'all know I got my little pink uh, straw topper on there. And then I put the purple um, wristlet bag in the back. So that's what I did for that one. And then the uh, soft touch is what I call this one. Uh, it's the, <laughs> the um, light pink box or light peach box, whatever color you want to call it is. Um, and then I use, of course, the, the book I just showed you um, early in the video um, with the tumbler cup to match and then of course the butterfly wristlet in the back and this is just my little floral design that I added into this one listen I did the best I could okay I wanted to make it orangey but at the same time not too orangey okay um, I added two gold bowls to this one because I just feel like the gold goes well with this whole color scheme and then this is the balloon choice now I don't have a lot of Mother's Day balloons designs um, so I just you know use what I could um, use to kind of coexist and color color coat with the um, boxes and I think these colors went out really well so these are my three designs um this is how I did them I hope you guys have got some inspiration behind this um and don't don't be afraid to tap into a little bit of uh let me back this camera back out don't be afraid to tap into a little bit of just being having fun with them um I just I needed this little relaxation moment and to kind of like back my mind off of you know life itself so i enjoy putting every last one of these together i y'all i don't whip 16 of these together okay 16 either 15 or 16 i know i got one left um that i need to do but i'm out of greenery so i gotta go get that but um i can't remember i the rest of them are downstairs but i wanted to show you guys these before i took them down so i give you like a little walkthrough of everything that's included in them so i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for watching and rocking with your girl still and we'll see y'all the next video don't forget to like share comment and what subscribe peace